Hi everyone, in this video, in QJS, I'm going to show you how to do the offset as you, the way you do it in your favorite CAD applications. So in QJS, you need to have your vector, which is like, it can be a line or polygon, but it should be like, for my case, it's a line, but it should be in projection, UTA. For my case, it's in meters, so it can be in imperial or metric. So you have a line here, so I want to do the offset. So in, in order to do this, you need to go to your processing toolbox or control shift, control alt T. For my case, it's on my right. So I'll just search for offset command here. So that means it selects the offset line so in vector geometry. So by double clicking it, so it shows this how algorithm works. So to make sure the input layer is in projection, for my case it's in 36 south of equator. Then this algorithm, that means putting a positive number, it will appear on my right, and putting a negative number of that distance, it will appear on the left. So I'll start with the positive number, for my case I'll start with 10 meters. Then segments 8, join style, this is about joining. Then create temporary layer. So it will create a temporary layer in the catch memory. So by pressing run, that means there's a line which will appear on my right, which is 10 meters from that line which was kept earlier. So this is it. So you can do a cross check here. It appears on the pane on sort of like gray color. So by, I mean like orange color. So here by doing a cross check, it's almost 10 meters. So if you want it to appear on the other side, that means on the left, that means you need to put a negative number here. So by going in front of that distance, then negative number, so it can be 10, can be negative, for instance, 20, depends on meters or kilometers or feet, miles or yard. So for my case, I put meters. So by pressing again a run button, that means that 10 meters will be on the other side, just like that. So by doing a cross check here, from here, just, I'm not very accurate, but it gives me almost 10 meters because I was not very accurate. So this is the way of doing it. So this is the way of doing offset in QJS as the way you do it in your CAD applications. So thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe for more videos like this. You will enjoy a lot. Gracias.